Wife and I want to add our son to the mortgage as a co-owner so that when we die, he automatically becomes the owner, having contributed to the mortgage payments. Can we add a third party to our joint mortgage? Paul, do you have anything else to add in this area? Yeah, just a couple of practical points to consider when it comes to adding other people to, to property ownership. Um, <clears throat> it's quite important to make sure that the timelines and the goals of each of the people are quite closely aligned. Um, and, and I'd say generally with, with you know, a son or a daughter, for example, although with their family, their timelines are very different to, to yours. Um, and certain financial decisions for them might be different to yours as well. Um, so making sure that that's all aligned, or there's at least an agreement, you know that that's not going to fall out of bed. Um, other things to consider is something that I've found people don't realise is that by going onto a mortgage, you aren't just liable for your portion of that mortgage. You're jointly and severally liable, meaning you're liable for the whole mortgage. Right. So, um, for example, if, if that son or daughter may not be actually living there, and then they, they want to go and get their own home or their own buy-to-let, well, lenders will look at them as being liable for the whole mortgage. So that could affect their, their ability to get mortgages elsewhere. Mm. So that's important to it's, So it's definitely very important to have family discussions, where you're at now, where you all hope for things to be, and what goals you might have for the future as a whole family so that everyone's outcomes are considered. Yeah.